فيا سائلا عن منهج الحق يبتغي سلوك طريق القوم حقا ويسعد تأمل هداك الله ما قد نظمته تأمل من قد كان للحق يقصد سبحانه وتعالى says help one another upon obedience and fear of Allah سبحانه وتعالى upon obedience and fear of Allah سبحانه وتعالى so a Muslim should help one another upon obedience a Muslim should call to his other Muslim for khair. But in reality, what we see is we call one another, hey, there's a party going on tonight. Let's go. Subhanallah. Hey, we're doing some things. You know, we're going to smoke up at the park. You want to come join us? Well, they're calling each other. They're going for a smoke at the park. Some of them even get worse. Yani, they get up to worse than that. They go to clubbing, they do fawahish with women and so on. And people these days are more focused on calling one another to the shar, to the shar, which Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, Wala ta'awuna al ithmi wal udwan. It's clear nahi. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is forbidding us, He's telling us, do not help one another, do not encourage one another on evil and yani, causing uh, affliction between one another. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is warning us of that. But yet we're performing that which he's warning us of. And we're not performing that which he's encouraging us on. Which is to call one another upon the good. And to call one another upon fear of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Next time, let's say for example right now. One of your friends calls you. And he tells you, hey listen there's a party going on. There's going to be this and that. There's music. This uh, artist is coming down. What's your answer? What should be your answer? You should tell him no. So how you how do you go about that? Do you just tell him no, or do you also call him to stay away from that? Okay. So how do you give da'wah to somebody who's a, who's about to do haram? We should always look at ourselves. How should we talk with somebody? Is how we should want others to talk to us as well. Remember, remember يعني, love for your brother what you love for yourself. If you love somebody to talk to you in a way that, يعني, that degrades you, that makes you look dumb and stupid and looks like يعني, somebody who has no idea of his religion, you won't like that. So how do you give da'wah to somebody who maybe doesn't understand this concept? What do you say to him? We as believers should call each other to khair. If you see this individual is always calling to shar, you should remind him that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala did not create us يعني, to disobey him, to call to that which he forbids. He created us to worship him. And part of his worship is to obey him. And you know, to obey him is to refrain from those things that he forbade us. So you need to give these examples and these, you know, sweet words, kindness to your brother so he understands these things, you know. I'm doing this for my Lord. I'm not doing this because my friend has said this. Or my friend is telling me to stay away from this. I'm doing this because I want Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to be happy with me. 